Breaking news in Queens. Police arrest a suspect in the murder of a young boy. Good evening. I'm Maurice Dubois. And I'm Christine Johnson. The arrest comes on the exact day Justin Wallace would have turned 11 years old. Police say the suspect turned himself in this evening. CBS 2's Jessica Layton live in Far Rockaway with more on tonight's arrest. Jessica. Maurice and Christine, this was a far cry from any sort of celebration, but the arrest is perhaps a small step towards some kind of justice for this grieving family. Three days after Justin Wallace was shot in the stomach at a relative's home, police believe they found the gunman. 29-year-old Jovan Young was walked out of the precinct in handcuffs around 10 p.m. Tuesday. He's charged with murder in the death of the child and attempted murder in the shooting of Justin's 29-year-old cousin. We're told police tracked the suspect down, somehow using the car and gun from the shooting. Police say surveillance video shows Young firing several rounds into a home on Beach 45th Street Saturday night. Night, possibly after a fight over shared driveway spaces. The little boy died a short time later. The next day, his inconsolable father shared with us more about the horrible moments of when his son was dying. Laying down, curl up. All I could have heard from my son one at a time, I am, <gasps> I said, oh my God. Then I started to tap him and say, wake up, don't sleep. Because he doesn't die, he's too young for that. So young, just a fifth grader who should have been eating cake and having a party today with his friends and family to celebrate his 11th birthday. The suspect does have one prior arrest from about two years ago. That's the latest live from Far Rockaway, Queens tonight. Jessica Layton, CBS 2 News. All right, Jessica, thank you.